Hey, Mom. I have a TV box. Now, this looks like a normal TV box, right? It's kind of big. It's a big bag. Okay, uh, so here's my haul. Um, I'm going to crack this open. And start getting stuff out because this one doesn't have any presents in it. <gasps> Yay! Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, so, very first thing on the top is a, I love, okay, so all the boxes, basically if you're getting something from Timu, you should expect it to be squished. Um, this is a manual breast pump. I am so happy for this because so far all I have are the Haka ones, um, and they're great, they're fine, but they don't get every last, dro every last drop of the goodness out, um, so I'm very happy to have them. This is such a good bag. My lap is not better, but, uh, okay. <gasps> okay, this is super cute. I'm gonna put this on the ground. This, I'm not, I'm probably not gonna try this on, on camera, but obviously I will be trying on. But look at it, look at it. Is it? It's got a cutout in the middle. I will say the picture made it look a lot smaller because it was like, that so it's like a little slit it's not like a huge gaping hole when it's all um whatever but i'm getting a thumbs up for my son <gasps> and look at this okay so one of the things that i've discovered is that they like to put like little pads in here to cover you know the boobage in your whatever in your bathing suits which is fine i understand you know there's some problems that you can have uh when you're cold for, like from getting out of a pool or whatever so these are great but these ones are small. They're not like adding like unreasonable amounts of padding that make me look like are you really that big or are you trying to come like these? No, these are perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And it's like this beautiful color. Ah, oh, guys, and it's got, and I, so, and I really like, you know, foresty things. So the mushroom pattern is really cute. Oh, I'm excited about this. Um, let's see, what else have I got in this bag? Okay. Ah, okay, so first, we'll look at this one first. What is this? Um, okay. It is, I'm actually not sure. I'll have to look on my order to see what it's meant to be used for. Because I don't understand, oh, okay, so it's, it's a class. I think I thought it was like a, so it's a clasp. So like, it goes like this, right? You have this little clasp and you can unclasp it. And I expected it to be like, you can clip it on whatever you want, but actually you're supposed to sew it on. It's got little like things for you to sew it on one piece of clothing and then it stays on that piece of clothing, which is fine. I'll use this sometime, it'll be cute. Okay, this, I'm pretty excited about this. Because, as you all know, I have been buying a lot of jewelry from Timu lately. This, this is a jewelry box. Sorry, I've got, I've got a child back here who's clearly trying to break the rule where I told him he was not allowed to be in the video. Which, if that happened, it would make me really cranky because then I'd have to review the video. Uh, okay. But it's like nice and compact. It's not very big when I mean, it's all folded up, which is nice because, you know, space, that kind of thing. But it unfolds and it can hold like a whole bunch of stuff. And it's got a mirror. Got a mirror in it. I didn't realize. See, there's that ring light. Okay. Um, but then it's also got like an extra little like foldy outy bit. I don't know what I don't know what this empty bit would be for, but this is really cool. So there's like spaces for earrings. Um these parts right here, these little hooks I think are for holding necklaces. Uh so maybe you put your necklaces and like drape them in the back or whatever. 
and then it folds up nice and small and can sit very tidily on my nightstand. And my, I don't have to have my jewelry just like blah, uh, all over my nightstand. Yay. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> These. Uh, there's another pair in here somewhere. Can I find them real quick? Can I find them? Can I find them? Uh, we'll find them when we find them. Okay, so these. Uh, these are actually one of the things that I got for you. I guess get over here. These are slippers. For mopping or sweeping or whatever. Okay. Put that leg down before you guys get a lot more, uh, than you want to see. Anyway, um, I got an orange pair for my son. <clears throat> so whether I have them go through and just like kind of sweep the floor or whether it's like we're gonna mop and then you guys can like come through and dry the floor. I don't know. It'll be fun. Please do not lose those. Put those in a safe place. Okay. So moving on. I have clothes. Um, I'm actually really excited about some of these. This is Okay, this is a crop top, clearly, but on me, like, okay, so here's the thing about Timu that I'm constantly forgetting. I buy crop tops from, like, Amazon, and they're, like, normal shirts for me. Timu is, like, all the, all the things on there are kind of for Asian women who tend to be much more dainty than American women. Um, so I think this actually might end up being a crop top on me, but that's okay because I can, like, I have high-waisted skirts and stuff, so I can just wear a high-waisted skirt with it, and I don't, like, actually, like, show any tummy, but obviously, most important, we've got nursing access, and it's a really pretty pattern. I don't know if you can see it. Really pretty floral pattern. I like it a lot. I've got a blue skirt that this will look really nice with, and I'll be able to wear the blue skirt again. Yay! Okay. Um... <gasps> this is another thing for a certain someone. <clears throat> this, I believe, is a... Hang on. Hey, Barracy, I'm making a video over here, so don't come... Don't! Don't come in the camera. Apparently, they're enjoying watching me make the videos here. Okay, so, here is... Uh, I think this is a popsicle maker. I think you're just supposed to put like juice or like a, maybe a smoothie mix or something. And then you've got these little sticks. Sticks like this. Like the pacifiers. And then you can, uh, yeah. By the way, Barlow, thank you for exercising constraint and not talking. Verity doesn't bother not talking because she doesn't care about my voice. Um, but, so you put your, and this is silicone. This is bendy and this is nice. Um, and then you put your stuff in here and then you just put your, nope, nope, nope. Um, this is upside down. So you get your color matching and then you turn it like that. And then you freeze it, and uh, then it turns into a and popsicle. it obviously turns into a popsicle. And then you can pull it out and take it out to the back porch and eat it. Enjoy a popsicle, and it's reusable and washable. Clearly, so that will be that'll be a nice thing for the summer. That's why I bought this. Is because we are two days away. Well, yeah, two days away from the last day of school. I was trying to do my math. Kids have two days of school left, basically. So we are getting ready for a summer of fun and not driving mommy crazy. And I think this may be a good way to start. Oh, okay, so cool. It comes with, um, so here it is all full up. And it actually has two extra little sticks. So it's got some extras, so that's good. Um, cool. Do you wanna take this to the kitchen, sis? And we'll yeah. wash it? Okay. This sucker. I thought about buying this for a while and I didn't realize that I did. I don't I didn't remember that I did. 
Um, but what this is, is it's a tie back for curtains. So I can take it and wrap it around the curtain and then clip it like this. And it'll hold the curtain so like it's not covering the whole window. So it'll be nice. I think it'll look nice uh, in certain places. I don't know. But as ever with Timu, not terribly expensive. So no great loss. There's a gold one too. Um, what's this? This one has the word mama on it. If I can get it out of the back bucket. Okay. I, finally, I went for, oh, this is a lot bigger than I expected. I finally got one of these Angry Mama steamer, um, like microwave cleaner things. And it's really strange. It doesn't, okay, so there's that. Um, like I say, it's a lot bigger. So, huh, it says vinegar on the back. Are you supposed to put vinegar and water in there? I don't know. But basically you fill it with water. Basically you fill it with water and you put the lid on it and then you put it in your microwave for a certain amount of time, which this is another thing. Um, it does have a box. Okay, so this is the vinegar fill line and then you fill it with water up higher. Cool, cool. You put it in your microwave and you run it and then it makes it easy to just wipe all the crap inside off. Uh, I've been saving up the dirt in my microwave for this. Just put it on the counter in the kitchen, baby. Um, so I'll have to let you know how this works. I keep seeing it on all of those. You should buy this, you know, 27 things you need from Amazon right this instant kind of a thing. Keep seeing it there. And like I say, it's not like I have a problem with some of that stuff and I'm interested in trying it but on Amazon it's like I don't have 10 extra bucks to spend on this you know this piece of plastic I do have a dollar I do have you know a dollar fifty that I can spend on it especially if it helps me to clean my microwave easier um let's see okay and oh this is pretty this is pretty this is a I think this is a belt like for me so like you would wear it around here. I like that, yeah. I mean, obviously I like it, I bought it. Um, it's, okay, yeah, yeah, it's a belt. And then you can just unhook it. I was confusing it. I think I thought it was another um, curtain tie back. Uh, so, but then you can just, like it's got this huge long chain so you can adjust it however you need it, whether you need it bigger or smaller, which I can guarantee you, I'm not gonna need it this small right now, trust me. Um, but it's pretty. Uh, what's this? <gasps> oh, this is fun. This is another one of those, I'm not gonna spend the Amazon money on it, I will spend the Timu money on it. Cause I'm pretty sure like it's, like, even if it doesn't have, you know, a brand or whatever, it's essentially the exact same product. But this is a, scalp massager for like the shower which I am pretty excited about actually um so I'm probably gonna use it I might let depending on how I like it and how she likes it I may let it be a thing that my five-year-old uses because of course with five-year-olds you have a really hard time getting the soap because they don't want to sit there and but if they have a little brush to just sit there and actually it does feel really nice um Anyway, so that'll be fun. Let's we'll see how that goes. Can I try it? Ooh. Um, uh, yeah, this is this chair is breaking underneath. One second. Is this like I don't remember. I don't, I can't tell. Sorry. That was a weird little whatever. It does it does feel really nice. It does, she says it does feel really nice, guys. Do you wanna let Barlow try it and see what he thinks? No, no, look at it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this, I'm super excited about. This is gonna go upstairs at my desk. And it's like a little, um, how does it run? Does it run on battery? Okay, so this is like a little vacuum. It does not appear 
to come with okay so it runs on double a batteries runs on double a batteries i've got to figure out where those go but it comes with this little whatchamacallit let's see oh it comes apart okay i think this thing comes out too what's this um it even can twist but it doesn't even get it tangled. nice nice so this is like a filter mm. Yeah, I'll have, to, I'll have to really look. So it's got screws in there, so maybe you take the screws out to put batteries in. I bet that's what happens. Anyway, um, and then you can clean up in here. It came with this little brush. But um, this will be nice for like vacuuming out a, vacuuming out like a keyboard. If you, get, if you eat over your keyboard and you get little crumbs in it, this will help with that for sure. So that's exciting. another thing for my kids. Uh, so we go out to sushi restaurants, you know, Chinese restaurants fairly often. And my kids are always like, can I have a pair of the, you know, where they take the chopsticks and they like roll up a piece of paper and put a rubber band around them. I found children's chopsticks on Timu and it was really not very expensive at all. And so now they can practice with chopsticks at home. Isn't that, and there's like even a boy pair and a girl pair and I have a boy and a girl. Go take those to the kitchen, guys. So that's fun. We'll have a lot of good times with that. Ah, avocado something. I think this is supposed to be like an all, like inclusive, not an all inclusive. I don't know. So like you slice around the avocado with this part, you glom onto the pit with this part, and then you like slice the actual like avocado with this part. And this is another one of those things. Like it obviously makes so much sense and it's cool, but it's like seven bucks on Amazon. And I'm just like, I'm sorry. I don't want to spend $7 for that. $2, a dollar, sure. Mama, I think we should use these for dinner tonight. <gasps> I think we're having that ravioli for dinner tonight. So you're welcome to try to eat ravioli with chopsticks. I want to. Cool. Okay, and then this is a pair of, ooh, this is a pair of tongs that is also a spatula. It is very, very heavily packaged down at this end, so. Mm. Apparently, I went right down through the kitchen, um, uh, whatever, in this, in this, order. Went through all the, I gotta, there's tape on here, I gotta cut it. Okay. Okay, so, um, nope, all the way in. And then, like, it's got, so you can slide it under and then, like, grasp it, but also it's got, like, a spatula thing to keep whatever it is from, like, buckling in the middle. So, yeah, that's cool. <sighs> I'm just assuming all of these are dishwasher safe because if they're not, <gasps> okay, mom, I bought a game. It's called, I should have known that. And basically this is how I live. Like I'd say 25% of every day is I should have known that. I should have known that. So I thought that this game would be a lot of fun. We'll have to play it sometime. It'll depend on what's in there because there's a lot of, like if it's a lot of grown up things, then maybe you won't be able to do very well because you shouldn't have known that. Ah, I'm excited about this one. This is a, another kitchen and gadget. I'm going all out on the kitchen things. It's, uh, um, it's, so it doesn't open, but it's a little thing where you can like scrub your knives, um, without hurting, like without damaging your sponges or your own fingers. So that is going to be very useful. Mama, um, Mama. Um, it says cutlery as well, so you could do forks and stuff. Let's Mama. See this Still on the chopsticks, baby. What's going on? Um, I washed these and I think they should go with, um, with the kids' stuff. That sounds great. Do it. All right. I've got something purple. Is it a shirt? I think it's a shirt. 
yeah, it's a shirt. It's pretty. It's got buttons, so it's a. Uh, it's obviously nursing access still, um, but I always love this. Uh, here I'm gonna stand up. I always love this kind of um, like pleated, flowy thing. It's very flattering on pretty much all body types. Are you trying to peek in my bag? Yeah. You crazy kid. He's trying to peek in my bag. How dare he? <gasps> the other pair. Now that now that Birdie's here, I can give her her pair. And these ones are purple. She'll probably use hers a lot more because, um, well, I say that. So far this year, she's been home on the days when the mopping lady comes, but she's going to be at school next year, so she'll probably use hers exactly the same amount as Barley will. Anyway, little shoes to wear on floors that need mopping. She's just like, give them to me. <laughs> Keep them safe, Verity. Put them in a safe place. Oh, she's going to put them on her feet right now. <gasps> this. Okay, so I want to, this dress was like $14, which no, ordinarily on Amazon, if I saw a dress that was $14, I would say that dress is going to be crap. That dress is not going to be high quality. I'm not going to want to wear it. But Timu has been a different experience. So I sprang for a $14. They call them, they, it's under like a vintage category, a vintage dress. It's purple with polka dots. It is actually legitimately buttoned down. So it is nursing friendly. And it's got like this nice full skirt. It goes to about my knees. Um, it's really pretty and it's got pockets. It's got pockets. So I will try this dress on at some point. Holy cow, this is gonna be a long video. Okay, no big deal. No big deal. Look, they're way too big for Well, that's okay, you can grow into them or you can wear your slippers inside of them. I knew this would be a big one because I've got a lot of things here. So, uh, this, no clue what this is. Pretty sure it's another kitchen gadget. I have to sort through my trash versus not trash. Okay. This, uh, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Okay, so it's broken. Cool. Definitely broken. Um, I don't know how to use it. So it's broken right here. You can see the plastic. The plastic is cracked right there. Uh, I don't remember what this is supposed to be. Is there more? No? Oh, I remember. Okay. So you hold it like this and you put little, so maybe the, maybe it being broken. I mean, it'll be annoying. I could probably send it back and get another one. But so you put like grapes or little tomatoes in here. And then you've got like a thing where the knife can just follow the lines down. And so you can put like four in a row and just don't know if it'll work. We were going to try it. Broken. Probably send it back and get a new one, I think, because that break is it's not going to last very long. This is egg slicer. I really, really hit the kitchen section hard this time. Um, but right now I am on like week two of being like, I really wish I, I really wish I would boil eggs. I really want boiled eggs, but I just don't boil them. I don't know why. Uh, but here you can slice, you can like, um, so I think the idea is, I guess you could put the whole egg in there, put the whole egg in there. And then there's this one, which will cut it in half for like devil eggs. So that's nice. You could just you don't have to like cut it with a knife. You can just squish it down. Um, this one cuts it into uh, six sections. Um, so like maybe for a salad or something. And then this cuts it into slices. Also probably for a salad. I don't know. Anyway, I'm excited about that because theoretically I eat boiled eggs a lot. I wish I did. I like them in salads. If I had them, I would be eating them every day. Also, I like deviled eggs, so that will really be helpful in making deviled eggs. Okay, this is for, I think this is a baby brush. This looks like a baby brush to you, right? Um, 
just for like getting rid of cradle cap or whatever. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's nice and soft. I wonder if she'll like it. I wonder if the baby will like it. I don't know. My husband is just like, Brittany, we do not need all of this junk. All right, here we go. Uh... This is another little, and it's, look at it, it's so pretty. I actually think I bought another one of these not too long ago. So I probably have two of these, but it's one of those that'll hold your, uh, hold your dress together. Very nice. Um, oh, is that a necklace? I think this is a necklace. It's really cute. Uh, it might be a little young for me. I don't remember why I bought it. <gasps> nope. It's an anklet. It's an anklet. It's got little daisies on it. You can't see them very. You can't very clearly see them because. Uh, anyway, it's super cute. Uh, I don't know why I decided to go all '90s and start wearing daisy flower anklets, but I definitely did. I forgot that. I forgot that I hit the anklet section too. What's this? Yes. Okay. I make cakes exactly never. I make like two cakes a year. One for Barlow and one for Verity on their birthday. But I am super stoked about this. This is a cake slicer. And I think I'm just going to have to tear up. I don't think there's a sticky thing on it. This is a thing where you can say, I want my cake to be, it's like got Um, little notches. So you could actually do it like at a weird angle if you wanted, but who, why, why would anyone do that? I don't know. Okay. Oh. So then you can take it and you can put it up at the height you want and then just like cake is on a flat surface. These little knobbies go on the flat surface and then you go through the cake and then your cake is flat and you don't have to worry about having, you don't have to worry about doing it wrong. I'm super excited about that. And that's one of the things that my husband's like, why did you make now you have to make, he'll see that and he'll like, now you have to make the cake. <laughs> He's been asking for a cake for a while. Um, this, this is like a, so what you do with this, it had more than one um, fruit that you can use, but it's for, I, like, apples was the one that, it did, and I think I just wanted to see if it worked because it wasn't very expensive. So you put this like in the middle and then you just start like screwing it and you get like spiralized. Oh, it's a spiralizer, that's what it was. It spiralizes stuff, which this this is supposed to be a knife right here. This is not, I'm touching this, no problem. It does not feel very like, very sharp. So I don't know how well it's gonna work, but you can just squirrel around. And then it's got the screw to keep it going around and around down into the, the but, like, the idea was it could work on um, cucumbers. I think cucumber slices was the one that I really wanted to use it on. So that's exciting. Having a lot of plastic things. Oh, that's so pretty. Okay, I got a ring. Okay. I got another ring. I got another ring. Uh, this ring is... Why did you take those? Those were not yours. Give those back to me. She took my, uh, refills for my aromatherapy necklace that I haven't got yet. Do you have all of them over there? They're not toys. Give them back. This is a hazard of having children as they steal your stuff. <laughs> Alright, so here's the ring. It does fit my finger. Um, I don't know. Come on, focus, focus, focus. Focus, focus, focus. It's not focusing. It's a very pretty little ring. Let's see, can I get it to focus? I don't know. Um, I really wish it would focus. 
focus? Because it's a really pretty little ring. It, um, no, it's got a rose on it. I mean, like, it's probably in focus way back here, but you can't see it. Put it down. You don't get to touch all my stuff, Verity. That's not yours. That's going to be easy for you to break. So put it down and stop opening it. Put it down. Thank you, Barlow. Let go of it, Verity. Just set it down right here. Children. Ah, is that the best that we're gonna do? Is that the best we're gonna do? Maybe if I just like get out of here totally? No. I wish. I wish it would focus on this pretty little ring. Hmm. It's a rose. It's really, really cute. Very detailed, very intricate. I like it a lot. Oh, sorry about that. Way too much time spent on that ring. I hope you guys are still with me. Okay, so it feels like I've got a big... <gasps> guys. This is not... Okay, so this is obviously... I'm like super excited about this, right? I am not going to wear this while I'm nursing because it's not nursing for me. <laughs> it's so cute. I love this dress. I am so excited about this dress. But not... Um, so like it's got plaid on it. The plaid isn't flannel or anything, which I was kind of expecting. I was hoping it would be, but it's not. Um, it, but it's in like a nice comfy material. Um, it has a hood. This dress has a hood. So. Uh, let's see. And then it's got like these buttons down the side. I'm going to have to like. Berg. I'm going to have to like try this on, aren't I? Because it's super duper cute yeah I really love this dress it's like super long yeah I love this dress already like I don't even I've owned it for like five minutes and it's adorable and I love it I love that it has a hood I think that's why I bought it I was just like I think I was searching sorry that was a lot of cleavage right there I think what I was doing without sorry internet I think what I was trying to do with that one was, um, something. Find a cloak. I was trying to see if I could find a cloak. So I keep buying all these little, like, whatchamacallits, and I've got the brooch from Lord of the Rings. And so I was just like, I definitely need a cloak. They don't have cloaks on there. Okay, so, uh, I hope I don't get in trouble for this. <clears throat> but I had a friend recommend them to me. And, uh, let's see. I'm gonna try to find all of them before. So the first first thing that I'm pulling out here that's not related to these, um, this is a butter slicer. And it's nice, it's like heavy and metal and stuff. But the idea is you have your like little like butter stick and you can just take a little, take this thing and just like chunk a little, like so you, so you line up one side with it and then you just chunk a little bit off. And you don't have to like get a, I don't know. And it's like a scoop, so you don't have to like get a knife. I don't know. I haven't tried it yet, obviously, but I, <laughs> I'm overly excited for this. So this is not terribly sharp. Like I don't, I don't, you could cut yourself on it, but you have to try. And this one, I actually got this one for my daughter, like, cause I thought she would love it. I don't know when I should give it to her if it's not broken. Okay. It's just like not even Okay, it's just not even connected to that thing. But look at it, isn't it? I'm gonna try to put it back on here because maybe if it has like a nice little... Um, background, it will be a lot clearer. I think this light is not helping in terms of focusing on things up close. But it's a, um, you kind of see it there. It's like a ballerina with a blue dress. And it's really, really pretty. She's going to love it. So, yeah. I don't know when I should give it to her. Should I save it for, like, birthday or something? Or should I just be like, hey, I've got something for ya. I don't know. We'll save it for now. Because once, once that egg's been cracked, you can't uncrack it. Um, so I got this from a kitchen. It's a strainer for the stupid side of the sink. 
you know, like you got the one that's like a big hole and that's fine. And then you got the other one that's like, I don't even know, but this is for that side of the sink. Um, but it's got a strainer in the top. So that's nice. Um, yeah, I guess the other ones that I've had always had a strainer in them too, but it wasn't a strainer like this. Because those ones kind of get blocked up easy. I want you to put that down. Okay, let's see. Um, okay. All right, so two things that are also not. How many? I got a lot of those, didn't I? I got like seven. Nope, nope, yes, it is. Okay, that's one, one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six here, guys. I know I got seven. So. I got seven. I don't think this is one of them. I think, okay, so I think this is another anklet. I'm a little sad because I'm pretty sure I got seven. Although maybe I only got six. This is an anklet set. So it's got like a little white beaded thing. And then, um, let's see, we've got am I going to do this? It's got like a, a pretty little rose with some leaves. So, uh, yeah, I might wear those whenever I start wearing my knit first because those are pretty, those are really nice. Um, I got another ring and this one I think is going to be on par with my little sunflower ring. I think I'm going to love it. Excuse me. I think I might I have a hiccup or a burp or something. So obviously you're not gonna be able to see this and it fits perfectly, but it's a little B. Mm, not gonna focus, dang it. Wish I hadn't done that. I don't know. I can't make it focus. Um, anyway, yeah, it's a little B. It's really nice. So, um, yeah. I, this ring light is kind of disappointing in terms of like focusing on teeny tiny things. And then this final thing here, oh, um, I don't know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll be trying on some clothes. This is like a 40 minute video. I don't know. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm a little surprised my phone has the space for it. So this is a pretty little necklace that is shaped like a hummingbird. It's pretty, I mean, it's, the painting on it is really gorgeous. They've got it like swirled just perfectly. Um, my kids are eating mac and cheese. Lunch up. So here's that. Just have a little hummingbird floating around your neck. Very nice. Um, and then the last thing, things that I thought I had seven of, but I guess I only have six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, looks like I only have six. Okay, maybe I'll find the seventh somewhere else. I don't know. Thank you, Bob. I'm almost done. Um, I so my friend told me about these. They're called waist beads. And the idea is um, you put them around your waist, and some of them are like fixed sizes, and so but these are elastic, which I don't know. Um, I might. I don't know how this is gonna work. Um but you put them around your waist and then like as your waist fluctuates so like it can be because you're you know losing weight or gaining weight whatever you want to do or even just because like as you go through the month or something um you can like feel how these like sit differently in your body so like you know at one point they may sit here and then they may slide down like you know when you're not as bloated after your period or something i don't know um but they're supposed to help with like body awareness um and I just had a baby, uh, and I'm, you know, not feeling the greatest about, you know, the way my body looks. So I thought I would buy some of these and get like a set to just kind of wear around, um, you know, to help remind me like, yes, you're nursing. Yes, you want to eat, you know, like 10 cookies right now. Maybe just eat two. Maybe just eat two. So uh, I'm excited about that. I was trying to pick colors, but I kind of wish I got a red one. I think, didn't, I think maybe the red ones were out. But I think if it had a red one, like it would have just been. You no, know, I think I ordered, I think what I 
I think I ordered a full on, so this one's like blue and gold. I think I ordered a completely blue one as well and I don't see that here, so. And green. Mm, I mean, I ordered a green one. Then I got like an amber one. Um, but I do think the red one was that. I think I would've got a red one if they had one. And then this green one is a little different. It's got little like bangles hanging from it. But these are all, all the same size, which is nice. Which I don't remember if there was a size when I bought them. I'm going over these like way too in depth as if I know anything about them other than they're bees and you put them around your waist. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, so here's my set of waist beads that I'll be wearing under my clothes. That'll be fun. Um, so yeah, mm -hmm. and that is my haul. So thank you for coming to my extraordinarily long Timu haul today. I hope you had fun. Um, yeah, thanks. Oh, dang it. It disconnected. Oh, it's 40 minutes is too long. Okay, maybe try now. Click.